All right, y'all. Uh, I went back on the Mega Drop Shop before it closed. Uh, I did, I did, and I got a few more things. I couldn't help myself. I found myself checking the sale every single day. I actually made two separate purchases. Okay, hear me out. The first time I made a $20 purchase and I was like, okay, I'm good. And then I checked back in again and I was like, oh snap, they got other things on there that I really want. So I made another $20 purchase. <laughs> they came separately, but I waited and combined them together. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. The first thing I got was a filler. Okay, a filler so that I could reach the um, the threshold for free shipping. And this is the two pack patchology hydrate hydrant hy hydrant hydrant scent thirst quenching cheat mask. And you only supposed to leave these on for five minutes. I like to leave mine on for a good fifteen. So it's one of these little patchology thingamabobbers. And I'm guessing since it has like the little tab thing right here. You just open it up, take one out, and then close it back up, and then use the other one later. Yeah, it's just like a little little sheet mask. It has hyaluronic acid, vitamin B5, Hydra Surge 5. What the hell is Hydra Surge? They just be coming up with all sorts of stuff. Of uh, a side hyalur... Oh, different language. That's what that is. <laughs> I was like, why is it listing these things twice? It's because one of them is in different language. Okay, makes sense. But yeah, cute little sheet masks. I have enough sheet masks. I don't need to buy any more sheet masks. I think I'm done when it comes to sheet masks. The next thing that I got was the Aceology Green Tea Mask. And I got it because it was on like a crazy sale. Like the sale was absolutely ridiculous. So I was like, I might as well. <laughs> oh, Aceology isn't even the brand name. The brand name is Beauty Brand X. I didn't know that. <laughs> I thought Aceology was the brand. All right, I I'm just gonna say this. What the hell? Why do they do that? Like, why even include this little extra spot right here? It's unnecessary. Just make the box this big. Why do you need that extra space where you're gonna just put like a little tab thing and then have nothing in here but open space? I don't understand why brands do that. Like, I, I see it all the time and it's just like, what the hell is that? But yeah, this is so cute. It looks like it's in like a little painter, little painter's thing bobber. But yeah, it's just like a green tea mask. Let's see, and cleanse, tone, apply a thick layer of the skin, leave for 20 to 30 minutes, rinse thoroughly with water. Sounds like a sounds like a plan. I have to do another super extra nighttime skin care routine that you really shouldn't do, but I should do it anyway. But I'm doing it anyways. I can't even say it now. I haven't done it in so long. Nice and safety seal. You know, your girl loves a good safety seal, but I haven't done one of those in so long. I've been slacking. I'm sorry. Okay. Life is lifing. <laughs> I've been slacking. We'll see if this smells like green tea. Let's see. Ooh, it's clear. I was not expecting it to be clear. I was expecting it to be green. Okay. I was really, really expecting it to be clear. Clean. Not clean, green. I can't even talk. But yeah, this is what it looks like. It's like a gel kind of consistency. Hopefully it smells like green tea. It almost just smells like dandelions. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah, it doesn't really smell like green tea. It just smells like dandelions. I don't know, but I'm gonna go rinse this off and I'll be right back. And I'm back. Yeah, so I mean, this is very interesting. It's a decent size for how much I paid. I think I paid like four or five dollars for this. It's very cheap. So yeah, I'm excited to try this out. Eddie. Nighttime skin care routine that you really shouldn't do what I'm doing anyways because I'm filming. I did it, I did it. I got through it that time. All right, the next thing I got is for practicality purposes. And it is the Mo Beauty Flawless Coverage beauty sponge. I got these because I had lost one of my beauty sponges, so I was down to one. And I recently found the other beauty sponge, but it's always good to have more beauty sponges because beauty sponges get gross and you really should switch them out often. Um, me personally, I throw them in the washing machine. <laughs> I throw my beauty sponges in the washing machine to get all the gunk out, but I don't know how many times I can do that before the beauty sponges are just ruined. So I got some backups. So they come in these uh, conflicting colors and they're squishy. I mean, they should be fine. They're slightly different. One has like a flat bottom and the other one is just like a typical typical sponge. Um, they do have branding on them, which is okay. Nothing too crazy, a little brand right there. You can't see it, it was so bright. But yeah, just they're squishy. They seem fine. I'm not like a snob when it comes to beauty sponges. The only beauty sponge that I got that I was just like, Hell no, what's that one from the Dollar Tree? That beauty sponge was trash, but these should be fine. I got these on a stupid deal. I think the deal was pretty good, so I'm happy about this. I should have got the bigger pack though. They had another one that was like a bag full of them. I would have been set for a 
years, okay? I would've been set for years. But I think this is this is fine. This will do well. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. I'm saving like the nice, nice stuff for last. The next thing is actually something I'm super excited to try. I've already tried a, another set from, like from the same brand, but a different scent and different like kind of mixture, I guess. But y'all, I went and got more of these pop masks. These are absolutely amazing. I love the chamomile one. The chamomile one is my jam. I actually ordered more of the chamomile one on Flip. You saw my Flip haul. Ipsy had these for like $6 a piece. So I got to, <laughs> I got to, cause these self warming masks are literally amazing. They are so relaxing. When I have a headache, I put one of these on and oh my God, feels amazing. If I'm struggling to sleep, these feel amazing. I just, I, I love them overall. I will say I'm not a fan of rose. I wish that they had a different, a different scent but we'll see how they perform. I got two because the deal was just so crazy. These masks for one box is like usually 20 some dollars, 20, $22. So to get two for 12 is a steal. And I mean, even if I don't like the smell of it, at least the warming part will give me some kind of comfort. You know what I'm saying? So that is definitely a win. I'll let you guys know how I really like it once I try it out. The next thing is part of my journey for a full face of LYS. And this is the LYS Secure Skin Gripping Serum Primer. And this is what it looks like. It says it has niacinamide in it, AHA. Okay, so it comes with some, some skincare benefits as well. I love their packaging. I just think this is so cute. The foundation came in a box similar to this. Oh, this is so cute. Bruh, get into it. Isn't this the most adorable primer you've ever seen in life? Like it's so itty bitty, but it's really cute. And I mean, for primers, you don't really need a lot of products. Like, let's be serious. And it has like the triangle background. You can see yourself in her. Okay, there you go. I just, I'm in love with this. I just think this is so freaking cute. It is safety seal, okay? It is nice and safety seal. You know, your girl loves a good safety seal. That way we know ain't nobody been in our stuff. Let's see the texture consistency. Ooh, okay, so it's definitely serum -y. Definitely serum -y, which I mean, it said it was a serum, so it did. Um, this will work really well, I think, with their foundation because their foundation is a serum as well. So I'm excited to try those out together. Let's peep the consistency. Ooh. And it is a little sticky. It'll probably get even stickier as it dries down. We'll let it dry and see what, see what it's working with. But yeah, very excited to try this out. I have to do another try on video because I haven't done one of those in a very long time where I just kind of sit down and try the different makeup that I get that's new. Well, new to me, maybe not new in production, but new to this household. I haven't done one of those videos in a while. So I'm gonna have to just sit down and get it done. This is it down and get it done. It's not that sticky. Okay, when it dries down, it is not sticky at all. But maybe it'll just feel good on the face. Okay, we'll we'll have to see how it holds the makeup. Okay, maybe it doesn't have to be sticky to hold the makeup really well. I don't know. I'm not a scientist. I don't know. The final thing that I got, which was the one thing I was like, was besides the primer and the pop masks. <laughs> This was the one thing I was super excited about because I kept adding it to my cart and like removing it for like the past month and a half. So this is the KVD Good Apple Skin Perfecting Foundation Balm. And this is what it looks like. I got it in the color medium 30. I've been eyeing this for such a long time because I saw videos of people using it and their skin looked flawless like absolutely phenomenally flawless. Hmm, that doesn't seem right. Okay, mine is a little flimsy. I don't know if they're all flimsy like this. Like, are they all flimsy like this where they can just open up without like, they like the clicking mechanism doesn't work? I guess it's not too bad. I'm probably gonna have to put like a little rubber band over this just to make sure it doesn't like fly open and then just, you know, smear foundation literally everywhere. But this is what it looks like. Absolutely cute. Okay, you can see your reflection. Christina Aguilera. Yeah, let's go ahead and do a little swap 
swatch swatch and see. Very, very nice. Will it be my color? I don't know. I don't know. But let's just, let's do a little swatch and see. Ooh, that is buttery. Okay, that is so buttery. I am here for it. Let's put it over the over the primer since this prepped and prime. And we'll just kind of blend that out a little bit. Oh yeah, that's gonna be a perfect shade. That's gonna be a perfect match. That looks good. That looks good. I'm excited to try that on my face. Very, very nice. Okay. Okay, KVD. I see y'all coming through with with the balm. Uh, we just gotta see how much coverage this gives. When I saw it on other people, it was giving like full, full coverage. So we'll have to test that out and see, okay? You, you know your girl got some spots. Okay, you got some spots. So we'll be able to tell if this is full coverage or not. But y'all, that was everything in my Ipsy Mega Drop Shop Hall Park. Did y'all go shopping? <laughs> did y'all do like I did and make a double back into the drop shop to get some last minute items? If so, let me know what y'all got. Cause I'm nosy, I wanna know. Did we get some of the same stuff or did you get something completely different? If you like this content, you already know what to do. Like, share, comment, and definitely subscribe so that you can become a Fae Bay. And I will see y'all with the next one. Deuces.